Lasers have developed into powerful tools for material processing. As with any tool, lasers will degrade in performance over time, leading to process uncertainties and even scrap. Total catastrophic failure of the process may result, but anyone can assure consistent, high-quality outcomes of their laser material processing by comparing current laser performance parameters to their historic, successful norms. Parameters critical to successful material processing include the laser's average power or energy, pulse width, pulse shape, and mode structure. Consistent monitoring of these laser parameters can alert the operator to even small changes in laser system performance. This permits adjustments or repairs to be made to the laser or beam delivery system before degrading processing conditions lead to inferior quality products or production delays. Some laser beams are too large to be measured directly by even the largest cameras or scanning slit-based beam profiling products. Beams too large to fit directly onto beam profile sensors can present a challenge to the laser technician. Ophir Spiricon offers the L11059 camera, which features a 34 mm by 26 mm active area, and the Pyrocam 4 pyroelectric camera, which provides a 25.4 by 25.4 mm active area. This video describes techniques one can employ to measure the mode, size, and stability of beams too large to be directly measured with camera or scanning slit type beam profiling sensors. Large beams can be measured indirectly with optical re-imaging techniques. Re-imaging techniques may employ a camera lens and diffuse target. In reality, the beam size is only limited by access to the laser beam and the available optical path length as larger targets may sometimes require longer imaging path lengths. Ophir Spiricon offers 25mm and 50mm C-mount camera lenses for re-imaging large beams. Optical scattering material, such as ground glass or flashed opal, may be used as targets to image the impinged beam. Targets with known spectral transmission and light diffusion properties make it easy to develop a benchtop or in-situ re-imaging systems for measuring large beams. Any spatially consistent material that will not be burned or damaged by the laser beam can be used as targets. Transmissive targets can be used in transmission or reflection mode. In either configuration, care should be taken that only the reflected beam and not the transmitted beam is imaged by the lens. In transmission mode, the camera imaging system should be placed slightly off axis to the laser so that the transmitted laser beam does not impinge directly on the camera lens. In reflection mode, the laser and imaging system should be placed at small equal angles at either side of the central axis perpendicular to the target. The beam gauge optical scaling feature permits the beam profiling and analysis software to account for any changes in the effective pixel pitch due to re-imaging. Optical scaling enables accurate spatial correction of laser beams that have been re-imaged for easier measurement. Off-axis correction is available in Beam Gauge Professional. It allows the user to correct for beam aspect ratio distortion when the beam under test is compressed in one axial direction. Two figures illustrate two possible applications where the camera or the laser is off-axis in the system's x-axial plane. A similar set of figures can be drawn with the camera and laser offset in the y-axial plane. Ophir Spiricon also offers two optical 4X beam reducer options. The 4X imaging beam reducer is AR coded for use at 1064 nanometers and 532 nanometers. The maximum spot size is approximately four times the active area of the camera that is used. For instance, when used with the SP620, the 4X beam reducer provides an active area of 28 by 21.2 millimeters. The 4X UV reducing converter operates in the spectral range of 193 to 360 nanometers. The effective aperture is four times the active area of the camera that is used, up to a maximum aperture diameter of 30 millimeters. 
Measuring the critical performance characteristics of large laser beams is no longer difficult. Improvements to beam profiling accessories provide the tools needed to understand and document large UV, visible, and near IR laser beams. When was the last time you profiled your laser beam? Schedule an appointment today for a Spiracon sales engineer to measure your laser and provide a report card on its performance, absolutely free. Call 866-755-5499 to discuss your application with a sales engineer or visit us on the web at ophiropt.com slash photonics. Ophir Spiracon the true measure of laser performance.